Welcome to SEC Saturday Night, presented by Holiday Inn Express. Number 20, Florida, undefeated in 3-0 Kentucky in one of the longest streaks in college football history. Will it come to an end tonight? Several have fallen over the last decade or so. We go back to 43 in a row for Notre Dame against the Naval Academy. That streak ended in 2006 in South Bend. Meanwhile, the second longest streak in college football history spanned the old Big 8 through the Big 12, Nebraska, and Kansas. That was 36 in a row for the Huskers over the Jayhawks. And Oklahoma and Kansas State, 32 in a row for the Sooners. And even Heisman Trophy winner Steve Owens wasn't good enough to knock him off in 1969. And now this one, three decades of dominance by this Florida team. They have been nail biters, buzzer beaters, and blowouts. See what has that has in store for us tonight. What I tell you about was that speed up front for this Florida team. It's helped in their takeaway department. Pick sixes abound, and they get great pressure on the quarterback. Eddie Pinedo gets us started, and the kickoff goes out of bounds. Backfield and Benny Snell behind him. And they're going to go play action. Conrad got knocked off his route. Last week against South Carolina, they want to be very deliberate offensively. Three-man rush. Receiver is out of bounds. Zeus Johnson is the receiver he really likes. They get it to him, looking for a screen, and Johnson gets stuck. Tweet. You might even see him throw it off it. There's going to be a lot of wrinkles we see on that tonight. Snell powers his way up the left side. Johnson over the middle. There's tight end C.J. Conrad. Highly decorated recruit in last year's class. Bolton can throw it. Eludes the first two. Here he goes. Number one, Bolton trying to find the outside. Walker in motion. Toss to him. Walker is able to gain the first down. Johnson comes back on another screen. Room to run. This is Cam Russ. Fights for more yardage. Do a good job rubbing with their other receivers, don't they? Johnson looking, penetration up front. On second and 17, Snell has room. Snell, not open to go to the end zone. Caught, great boom. Touchdown, Kentucky. that a little bit emotions are running high already play action looking to get it to the outside here's Tony great playmaker for Florida he changes direction Tony's got room on the edge if he can get there and a big game for the Gators past the 40 Franks the outside again this is Tyree Cleveland and the play was even supposed to go to Cleveland it's easy to slough off or Four-man rush, ball deflected and incomplete yards passing thus far. They like to keep the throws short. DeAndre Goolsby for the Gators. Franks on play action. Let's one go deep down the sideline. Him bouncing back was not a surprise. Here's Mark Thompson. First down run for Florida. Brought himself at 240 pounds. Daquan Green in his wildcat. Pardon me, Kadarius Tony. And Tony shakes one. He's going to break free. Kadarius Tony out of the Wildcat. A dose of Kentucky's own medicine. And it's a 36 yard run. Steven Johnson wants to put it in the air. And it's complete for a gain of five. They're an opportunistic defense with all the takeaways and scores. Sahin King has a first down run. King in motion. Here's Benny Snell. How much room in the boat with Landon in there? On second and five, Johnson tries to reverse field. And he fakes the jet sweep. Trying to find a crease. Back to Johnson at quarterback. And on the read, he read it wrong. And getting his running back closer to him, so he hits that quick out of the backfield. Snell couldn't hang on. And Florida's got to deal with the crowd and bad field position. <laughs> Franks finds his own batted pass. Down hit the ground. Johnny Townsend, a true weapon. 
Gets off another good one. Charles Walker had plenty of time to try and make something happen. 15 yards of steam. Walker to the 30. Tight roping. Charles Walker all the way down to the 10 yard line for Kentucky. 59 yard return. Extra yards at the end. Benny Snell. And very animated. Second and goal now. Corner end zone. Caught. Touchdown. Juice Johnson. Just, you're just going to skip over the Vandy score. Here's Malik <laughs> Davis. I tried to. He's over the last three decades, but not anymore. Big hit. It's an incredibly talented pass rusher off the edge, Josh Allen as well. And down three for the Gators. Back to the run game. Whistle. End around. And the Gators have Tyreek Lee. Pressure. Franks will escape. Try to pump fake. They're going to run it. And they won't get it. Mark Thompson. Uncovered is Tyree Cleveland. And now he's in a foot race. Shoved to the pylon. And if he didn't step out, that's a touchdown. Side judge looking for help. It's sorted out here. The ruling on the field is a touchdown. Nothing doing for Kentucky. So that's out there every morning milking the cows before everything got automated. And he gave credit to doing that work on the farm with strong hands as a youngster. Johnson uses his arm. To... All day. Over the middle. Wide open. Juice Johnson at the 30. He's up the throwing windows underneath. Hot pass Conrad. The tight end of the five. He's in. Touchdown Kentucky. We got to beat tonight, I think. Pressure. Franks escapes it. And on the run, Bob Old and incomplete. Mark Thompson, nowhere to go. Helmets for Juwan Taylor. See if they hold. Franks, happy feet. Trying to run, nowhere to go. Kentucky with the ground game. Saheem King has a seam. Trying to beat the safety. And they take him down at the 35. He's hitting for big plays. This is the eighth Kentucky possession and the seventh time they've made it into Florida territory. High snap. Johnson handles it and he gashes the Florida defense. Right. And Johnson in motion. Oh, little touch pass to Steven Johnson. Here's the razzle dazzle. Bowden will let it go. Wide open. King. And he's down to the five. There's sometimes time up that jet sweeps. Not up your alley. Oh, King really struggling with snaps. Or pardon me, Snell. Or. Johnson trying to set up the screen. Through a tight window. See that fade from the inside guy that we saw last time. Another wild snap. Johnson will fall on it. And he got it. But what we've seen, Kentucky's been really good at mixing up their fronts and mixing up their pressure. We've seen Courtney Love come through the A-gap untouched a couple times. And there's no excuse for that other than it's misidentification by the center and or the quarterback. So having a senior, a, a more veteran guy in there that can see the protections, point the right mic out. Obviously from a football family and a lot of reps under his belt can take over that responsibility. And then playing not good and then the injuries, everything kind of all into a perfect storm. Off balance, lob. Powell leaves his feet to pull it in. The Notre Dame transfer. Del Rio looking sideline. Now over the middle. Intercepted! Darius West with the takeaway for Kentucky. Going to third quarter. Del Rio pulls it back. Deep crossing route to... Mo Little swing pass. And once again, it's Florida has changed quarterbacks and Luke Del Rio off play action looking deep. Everybody covered. Del Rio will find the sideline. To run your normal offense. And so they'll run it on second and ten. 
And Malik Davis is able to find three, but only three. A draw. Del Rio staring him down over the middle. It is incomplete. And giving out another opportunity. Here's Benny Snell. Wow. Strong, strong stiff arm. The back. You Broke. saw it all right there. Thousand yard rusher last year broke Randall Cobbs. The, uh, my, my favorite saying uh, from the Patriot, aim small, miss small. Okay. <laughs> Got to focus on what, what's in front of you. Five. Johnson. Incomplete is the holder. McGinnis one for two tonight. And good. Del Rio in a quarterback for the Gators. A little option look. They're going to reverse it to Tony who wants to throw. Heaves downfield. Man open. It's Cleveland. And he's got a Florida first down. Davis has been the workhorse in the second half. They need three. They get it. And then some. It's Malik Davis. And they're finally knocking on the door. 9.19 to go. And Malik Davis again. It's Malik Davis again. Del Rio split to the top of the formation. Powell will take off left. He's got the first down, and he's got the pylon. He's in! Touchdown, Florida! Brandon Powell's first carry of the night. It's a six-yard scamper for a score. Steven Johnson pulls it back. Now he'll try to find some room up the middle for Luke Del Rio. On second and eight, pressure. Johnson dropped. Florida gets another sack. Gator defense trying to get the ball back. Johnson pressured. Caught but out of bounds. Only one's longer. Del Rio hands off. Plenty of room. Drive. I think he's calm, poised, and ready to lead them downfield. Well, guy comes in motion. To Powell out of the backfield. He needs six. Powell sneaks free. Where's the spot? He got it. Back to Malik Davis. Out of the timeout. Del Rio going play action. Got a man deep. He's going to heave it towards the end zone. It is incomplete. Del Rio wants to throw. Surveys, jumps, complete to Mark Thompson, and a Florida first down. Second and ten. Malik Davis off the toss. To Goolsby out of the backfield. He gets up in it and dives forward. Malik Davis, first down Florida. And it. Akron. Here's Davis to the five. Third and one. Kentucky trying to run a man off wide open. Touchdown, Florida. Freddie Swain was left all alone. And for the second time tonight, Kentucky gets caught napping. Johnson looking for a screen. Here's Juice Johnson. Trying to get out of bounds. He's got the first down. Of the defense. Line holds. Johnson over the middle. Incomplete. Screen. Snell. Nothing. Johnson pressured. Hit as he throws. It is caught for Kentucky. First down to Charles Walker. Field goal range here. They'd like to be closer. Here's Benny Snell up the middle. Seven seconds to go. Six. Holding. Offense number 68. Ten yard penalty. Second down. Florida maybe lined up offside. No flag there. Quick hitter to the outside to end 30 years of futility and to put the mistakes tonight in the background. Distance. No. And Kentucky comes up short again.